Welcome to another episode of Real Life with Trouble. I'm here in Biakis in Burbank, California. A little place I like to show you guys that I like to eat and probably a lot of you guys don't know of. So come check it out. And this is where we're gonna be getting. And we're probably and we're gonna get a Yakko burger. We'll check that out. Hey, can I get a, a Yakko burger? Okay. Yakko burger? By itself or combo? Uh, by itself. Yeah, let me get a bulldog with two bulldog sauces. Yeah, just one bulldog, and that'll be it. Got the order in. Trust me, when we get home, you guys are gonna love it. It's so hot. It's supposed to be 102 today. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. But uh, I hope all you guys are doing good. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, like, and comment. But yeah, this is the original Yaki Bowl. I don't know how many more left, but this one's here in Burbank, uh, 20 minute shot from Universal Studios. Uh, I was gonna go to the park today, but I was blocked out, as you can saw at the beginning, but oh well, it is what it is. <laughs> so, but now we'll just wait up for our food, and we'll take it home, and we'll review it. So, and I'm home. We got the food. <laughs> so, we get in here, one bulldog. I don't know you were so you were up here, you were here. Oh, one bulldog. Napkins. Gotta have napkins, it's, it's messy. One bulldog sauce. You know, I'll tell you a little bit about this in a minute. Ah, uh, they didn't give me no yaki sauce. Basically, it's like a teriyaki sauce, but their version of it, and it's superb. And a yakko burger. Now, a yakko burger is chicken and beef patty put together with cheese. This is the mecca of the burgers. But let's start with the, the bulldog one, huh? Let's, let's do it. First time I tried this was in mid 2000s. Okay, when I went to, when I found Yaki's the first time. And I knew the owner. His name was Mario. And man, I love that guy to death. I mean, me and him used to chop it up all day long and eating his burgers and fries, of course. <laughs> but yeah, he kept telling me, oh, this is a secret sauce, this is a secret sauce. But it, it, it's teriyaki with like a mayonnaise, sriracha almost, a very light sriracha. It's not spicy at all, it's sweet. But the only reason I say sriracha is they give it that color, as you can see. But you dip this one, first thing first. Huh? Wow, I've never seen my bulldog like this before, <laughs> full blown out, like inside, you can see the hot dog in there. So basically a bulldog is wonton with a hot dog and cheddar cheese wrapped up in this and deep fried. And, you know, I'm gonna start from the good side because I don't know what happened there. And uh, you wanna mix that teriyaki, you wanna t mix the, the yaki sauce with the bulldog sauce. I don't know how the hell I said that, but <laughs> here we go, guys. Taste us. Mmm. No. 
I'm going to give this up to people that are very particular like me. They use weenies. I like beef. I would rather have like um, Nathan or um, I forget the name of the other one. But like an all beef hot dog, you know what I mean? Like It tastes good. It doesn't taste bad. But because of how particular I am about what I eat, I really wish it would switch. I had told him like several times since Mario died. Yes, the owner passed away and left the business to his son. I told him too, beef. You should really switch it to beef, just charge more. I don't care, I'd rather have beef, but it is a weenie, which is all all byproducts. And uh, I really don't care at this point because you know, it's so good. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. No, it took me like 20 minutes to get home. So consider the fact that cheese isn't dripping right now because of the trip. No. To the burger. Let me get a napkin though. They really gave me one napkin. <laughs> Let's get to this burger. <sighs> oh, what is that? Yeah, that's the chicken right there hanging out. Like, oh my God, this is a perfect picture for you guys. Look at this thing. That's chicken. Bro, uh, char broiled chicken inside is a patty underneath it with cheese ultimate burger right here and now normally i would take the yaki sauce and pour it over they put yaki sauce on it already so don't don't fret if you forget the yaki sauce but when you're there ask for it they will not give it to you voluntarily <laughs> mm -mm, mm -mm. Mmm, 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 mmm. Yeah. That chicken. You can taste immediately the char. I love that. The recipe has not changed since the beginning of when it started from when I don't know before it started before me. But when I got there, I got to know the owner for many, 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 many years. Like a couple of days, like a decade and a half. <laughs> but he passed on and to Mario's legacy lives on in these burgers right here. It was a 20 minute drive from Universal Studios. You can see my tie, I was ready to go. Now the place I'm going to, I'm gonna put the address right here. Sorry, 904 Alameda Avenue, Burbank, California, 91506. And their phone number is 626-589-5786. So when you go there, tell them the trouble sent you. <laughs> and you'll thank me. This food is amazing. Everybody I've ever taken to, they're all like, where do I get baptized? <laughs> that's how good it is but guys thank you so much for joining me i'm sorry we didn't get to go and do universal studios uh, with their blocks but they're not blocked i mean i'm blocked today i'm not blocked tomorrow so who knows i might pull out another video if i have the energy we'll see i don't know if a lot of you guys know i suffer from multiple sclerosis and um i try to i'm trying to cut down cut down on my drinking which is uh speaking of I found these Budweiser Zeros, guys. Anybody trying to quit drinking? This is it. 0, 0.0. Now, don't let some fool you. Some of them will sit, will be 0 0.3, 0 0.4. Nah, -uh. we're trying to quit. We're trying to do something for real. So, 0, 0.0 Budweiser. I'm endorsing this. I don't give a shit. They don't pay me. It's refreshing, it's crisp, it tastes just like a Budweiser. If I would, it would be between a Budweiser and a Bud Light. But it doesn't matter. It makes me happy. I'm content and I'm gonna live longer because I'm trying to be here for my daughters and live a long life for them. So if anybody out there, you guys are trying to quit, 
<laughs> okay, that's enough rambling with that. I love that you guys came by. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment. I love you guys all my heart. Stay positive. Put it out there because there's so many bad things happening. And we have enough tension in the world. We need to let some tension release. So go fishing. Go for a walk. Sit down and play Legos with your baby or baby boy, baby girl, either one. You have to always find a little time for yourself, just a little. And that little is a lot. You know what I'm talking about. Thank you guys for coming to my show. And tomorrow, hopefully we make it to Universal. So for now, goodbye. Thank you guys for coming. All, all hail Slytherin. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow. Peace.